Alrighty, people, welcome back to another video. It is time for another fighter showcase. Where's the man? Tiago Santos. He should be right here. There he is. Tiago Santos, the man with the hammer. With Thor's hammer on his chest. But I've been I've been trying to use some of these new fighters in the light heavyweight division. Of course, we tried out um Johnny Walker. Johnny Walker did not feel like he was supposed to, so it's really hoping that Tiago Santos feels exactly how he's supposed to. Of course, he's supposed to feel explosive, um, fast. Um, his leg kicks, just overall, he should feel very, very explosive. Very explosive. That is the one thing that a lot of these new light heavyweight fighters feel. They feel very athletic, they feel explosive, they're fast. So uh, we're facing Luke Rockhold. <laughs> Let's go. Thank you, sir. Oh, Jesus. Right away. Right away. I can say it feels heavy. But... We'll see. Most to the body. Tiago Santos, of course, is known for his leg kicks. His capoeira. That was supposed to be a teep to the body. Caught that one. Spin an elbow. And he's also known for switching stances, so we're going to stay in softball for a little bit. Locked. Man, I don't like how I don't like how sluggish this man feels, man. Why do they feel so bad? Huh? Like visually he he looks fast. Like, you know, he he truly does look fast visually, but just the feel of him. He just feels heavy. He feels like a heavyweight. I don't know why. I don't know what, what's causing it. I don't know if it's the animations. Because I think his stats are very appropriate. His stats are okay. For some reason, he feels like I'm moving around Mark Hunt in there. Speaking of Mark Hunt, is he in this game? Oh boy. Now I'm curious. Back up. So, just from the very first round, from the very first round, I don't know what it is. I'm not sure exactly what the issue is with a lot of these new fighters being added to the to the game especially in this light heavyweight division right now a lot of these guys just don't feel right like i said thank you visually they i mean he looks fast stay in softball for a little bit visually he looks fast but i'm just not sure maybe it's something i need to think about a little bit more to see if i can pinpoint what the issue is but he's given me that same feeling that johnny walker did I'm very curious to see if Dominic Reyes is going to give me the same feel. 
Crowley. Well, we'll try Dominic Reyes afterwards. Maheta. My opponent is rarely throwing combination. This just boom, 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 boom. If you look at the way he's throwing his strikes. Oh, he's trying to overcommit my block and land an overhand. I keep leading with that rear uppercut. There we go. go that's that's landing very clean rocked set him down with the rear uppercut and that should be it bomb luke rockhold gets ko'd in the classic luke rockhold fashion <laughs> with his with his butt sitting right next to the cage that is the classic classic luke rockhold ko position yoel romero ko'd him right there Michael Bisbee also KO'd him right there. This is just classic, dude. Classic as hell. He always gets got, gets sat down right there, and, and they get pounded out. Classic, classic. Okay, let's move on, people. Houston, we have a problem. We have a problem. It is no more light heavyweight in ranked. The weight class changed, so we're gonna have to do this one in quick match now. Sorry. We're gonna have to finish this showcase in quick match. And of course, the, for the very first fight, they throw me in the kumite. That's, uh, that's, that's to be expected. That is to be expected. That's what they always do. You wanna touch Dominic? Thank you, sir. Let's go, Dominic Reyes. Oh my god, what? Wait, hey, hey, hey! Are you, are you crazy? Get up. Man, I hate how these fighters don't do the technical get up. Like, they just get up like a grandma. I guess that was a technical get up right there, but that was a bum, bum ass technical get up. Dude, this dude is this dude is asking to get freaking flattened right now. Are you crazy, bro? Sit down. This is not gonna last. This dude is way reckless. Way reckless. Yeah, these elbows are doing a number on him too. Like, I can just fire up. There we go. Jesus. Homeboy was reckless. I suppose he was trying to he was trying to be aggressive with Dominic Reyes, but I just don't think he understood. He, he didn't really know what he was doing. He was just kind of pressing buttons. Boom! Beautiful elbow. After I ducked the shot clean. Boom! Flatten him right there. I love that sequence. Anyways, let's move on. And we are facing a giant, people. This is one of the funniest character models in the game right now. Anthony Smith's character model. You guys are going to see. If you haven't seen him yet, he looks ridiculous. <laughs> Look at this character model. Thank you. Look at this. Look at how big this dude is. It's like, like he's damn near two weight classes above like he's a super heavyweight just something about the scaling is so off 
Anyways. Oh, that was a miss. Yeah, this is another guy that's pretty reckless in this. Uh, well, not really. I want to say he's reckless. Uh, he's just all over the place. Like, there's no coordination. And I think, like, he doesn't know what he wants to do. Yeah, that's the one thing a lot of new players will do. They'll just come in and just press buttons. He's got some combos, though. Yo, don't get elbowed. Don't get elbowed. Looking for it. That's your legs. Those legs are gone. Tiago Santos style. Double up on it. Dude, you're about to get elbowed. Hmm. No, nice brute force right there. Dude, Tiago Santos has spinning back a spinning back fist. Yes, he does. Okay. There's their elbow. Now, of course, you guys know to throw the spinning the spinning heel kick to the head in this game, you have to hold the spinning back fist input. Front kick. Sit him down. Can we get him out of there? Not quite. Okay. Round number two, I'm going to see if I can work in some spinning back fists in here. See if we can do if we can do some work with them. I do enjoy throwing that strike in UFC 4 now just because the block is weaker. And, you know, the spinning back fist in UFC 3 was kind of useless just because a lot of times... You know, it just doesn't bleed through enough. And it is a very risky strike to throw. Like, the recovery on a spinning back fist takes forever. Of course, they can duck it. It's easy to read. Just high risk, low reward type of strike. But um, in UFC 4, it's, 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 it's the opposite. So we'll see what we can do here. Thank you. There we go. He's got him. Okay. See if I can catch him coming in with it. <laughs> Ooh. That is fast. That is the one shot from Tiago that I can say is fast. Get up, brother. Yes. <laughs> oh, my God. Leave a like for that one. If you have not liked the video yet, just go right ahead and smash that like button for that one. That was emphatic. That was clean. I think he leaned into it too. Whoa. Boom. Oh. oh my god. We almost broke that man's neck. Beautiful. Let's do one more. We are back to the Kumite. <sighs> okay. I'm ready. Alexander the Mauler. The Mauler Gustafsson. Touch it. Thank you, sir. Bring it, brother. Bring it. Bring it. He goes for a leg kick to start things off.
Okay, this dude's not bad. Right away, I can tell. He's at least thinking about what he's doing. Nice check. Dude, the sound of these punches as they connect. <laughs> I don't even know what I would say the sound is. Jeez, like gunshots. Take down. <laughs> Anytime you throw a kick, there's actually a sound effect. Like, you, you guys hear that? There's a woof. When you throw a kick, it's like a woof. Woof. Sound effect. <laughs> I can't, I can't not hear it anymore. I can't not hear it now. What the hell, dude? What the hell? <laughs> okay, let's try to focus. <laughs> oh my god, I'm about to get KO'd, bro. I'm laughing so hard, man. <laughs> Stop it. <sighs> Woo. Kumite, man. Whoa. This is this is just glorious. This is glorious. Glorious, man. You know some it was somebody's idea, man, to put in these sound effects. Thank you. It was like, yeah, we're gonna put in sound effects for the kicks. Great idea. Hey, it's funny though. Know? It's funny, it's fun. It is what it is. Who in the world is this referee anyways? Like, who, who the heck is he? And bro, why are you sitting in front of big drums and you're not playing it? Oh my god, I'm rocking. You guys see that dude sitting right there in front of big fat drums and he's not even playing it? Like, what the freak? Play some drums, homie. Stand in there. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Sit him down. There we go. That spinning back fist is doing a number on him. Hmm? Almost.
I mean, I'll be honest, man. I mean, these Kumite fights are kind of fun. They really, they really are. It's, uh, you know, wouldn't be my first choice in my mixed martial arts game, I'll tell you that much. But, um, once you, uh, suspend, once you just, once you get over how, like, ridiculous it is, you can actually start enjoying it. And that's what I'm trying to do with this game, bro. You know, the, these, the casual elements, the unrealistic elements, the, the, the elements, you know, the parts that are just supposed to be gimmicky and fun and just, you know. Oh my god. No! Snuck that one in because I was rocked. Okay. But yeah, man. Uh, you know, the, 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 the parts of it that are supposed to be just, just fun, you know. Just straight up fun. Um, I can get into it. I can get into it. Got him. Oh, sit him down with that spinning back. Dude, I'm loving the spinning back fist for Tiago. Tiago right here. Feels nice. Feels really nice. It's it's the one strike he, he has that I've used right now that actually feels like him. Like it's 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 fast, it's explosive. Perhaps the key is that I should just get wild with him, right? Yeah, I'm gonna revisit some of these fighters and just get wild, get get loose. Same thing with. Uh oh, the elbows are coming. The elbows are coming. Careful. Get out of here! No, no, you got you got that the first time. Not anymore, brother. Not anymore. That spinning back fist is so beautiful, man. Oh my god, I love this. Rocked. Sit him down. <laughs> These sounds, yo. Oh, they're perfect. Uh oh. Oh. Beautiful. Another elbow. That should be it. Beautiful. K.O. Game over. <laughs> Game over indeed. This is where we are going to end this. Man, final verdict on Tiago Santos. I think maybe the way I was using the character was the wrong way to use him. Like maybe I should just get loose, get wild, get crazy. We're going to revisit these characters and try them out a different way. But for now, man, I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Thank you for watching. It means a lot. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Follow me on Twitter at MarshallMind1. And I will see you guys later with a brand new one. As always, stay safe. Peace out, folks.